Hello friends, welcome back to Laravel 9 tutorial. In this video, we are going to discuss about how to export a PDF, right? Suppose you need a report or you need some data to export into the PDF for different different purpose, how you can do this, okay? So for this, so we have a Laravel 9 person and I have already created a list page of students. So if we just go to the student list, then you can see the student list these are the four record and i want to export and this record basically coming dynamically from the student table right so this is the table and from here actually this record is coming now i want to export this record into the pdf okay so there are several method different packages to do that i will show you one of the most used packages that is the dom pdf so just go and search dom pdf laravel okay and you will get the link that is the very vth laravel dom pdf link actually i will use this thing so to install into your application we need to uh, use this thing so first let's install into your application so let's uh, close the server and uh, just install into your application okay so composer require very vdh laravel dom pdf and it's installing into your application so the dom pdf version is 2.0 and the composer is updated and the publishing completed okay that means laravel dom pdf installed into our application now the next things we need to configure dom pdf into our application okay so how we can do this so just go to your application inside the app there is a web.php so just go to inside the configuration section so where is the configuration yes this is the configuration there is app.php here i need to set the configuration basically there is two types of things that is one is the uh, aliases path and one is the provider okay so all the providers should be uh, add here and to call into your application you can use here as a aliases right now how we can insert this so just go here and here you can see to register very vdh dom pdf service provider class so actually we need these things to include into your um, provider array so just go here inside the provider array just add another so simply write very vdh dom pdf service provider class and i need to call this from the aliases so simply uh, you can see that uh, they are in laravel they are using example class to help that is you can understand how we can set aliases so here you can see i need to create aliases the name is pdf basically using pdf will call the dom pdf so simply write very vdh dom provide and uh, here the facets okay so this is the basically facets part okay now added this facet now using this pdf we can call from our uh, application from our controller right so now we added this app.php so let's publish these things so how we can do this simply just uh, go here and simply write php artisan vendor okay and then we need to publish okay and what actually i am going to publish we are going to publish a provider and the provider name is um, provider equal to and the provider name is these things so just go here this and paste it here okay i close the semicolon and and now enter this so publishing is complete right now uh, let's start the application let's see whether my application is correctly running or not so php partition serve and it's working fine okay so after uh, installation there is no problem we are getting the list right now the next thing is we need to export this into the pdf so here you can see in the student controller uh, we need to use this uh, um, PDF so simply just uh, use the PDF okay 
so we can use uh, anywhere from our application using this pdf the first thing next i need to export only the record part okay so let's create a view and just uh, um, create a view with this listing so that when we uh, export the whole page will be export that will be great for a uh, reporting suppose in your report there is a multiple images graphs all those things just design in html and just print the whole page right so this is the very cool features of dom pdf now just uh, these are the student list page so i just copying here and editing the student pdf export or student pdf export okay this is a good and uh, proper name student pdf export dot blade dot php okay so this is the file now i just uh, going to add one function so simply uh, just write a public function and here write simply um, anything export pdf okay so this is the function and here i will just uh, call this return view sorry return view and student pdf export and i need this data also so i am just adding this so actually in the uh, student data in the student this is a student model i already included using student model we are getting all the data and i have to pass that data to the student pdf export right now just go to the student pdf export section so here just uh, go to the um, resource views and uh, student pdf export section and i don't need this student listing or uh, success message or these conditions so i just removing this and i don't need the action part actually i am referring these things action part and i just removing and also i don't need uh, this part also okay so i am just removing that part right now just save this and here if i just going to call this export pdf then we can see a page with only this list okay so another thing i need to remove that is the add section okay i i already ex i already removed okay so no problem now just uh, uh, call this export video function from web.php so just like the previous one i think you will understand what is this actually so student uh, PDF export or simply write PDF export okay so this is for demo purpose and um, there will not much function so simply write export PDF I already uh, created a video for different different things and I already showing you the how the crude application is created and how these are working you can uh, see my playlist and playlist link are provided in the description section so now just go to the PDF export part and simply write here and you can see the only list are appear great now the thing is i need to download all the things from here right so how can i do this simply simply just uh, close this thing i don't need to pass in this way or i don't need to return the view simply just uh, uh, write here dollar pdf equal to what i actually added as an lis pdf double colon that is the scope resolution operator and simply i will load the student pdf export view with the load view method okay and now just uh, write these things okay so using uh, this uh, way actually we can uh, pass and we can load the view also so the student pdf export will be load into the pdf and finally i need to download the return okay so return dollar uh, pdf so what actually i created and just make sure we are downloading these things download okay and finally what i will download suppose after downloading uh, my file name will be student uh, pdf or student list dot pdf right now just go to the browser and refresh this so here 
um, it can see the student list dot pdf so if you just click on this we are getting all the record properly uh, how the uh, list is showing how the page is showing it is downloading exactly same right so my name i provided the student list here and the list are appearing in the student list and all the things okay so this are actually coming from the header section right great so this is all about the student uh, list page so you can understand how pdb is downloaded and this is the very cool things and it is downloaded exactly the same like uh, these things right so you can do it easily so still if you have any queries about this video please comment in a below comment section and next day we are going to discuss about another things suppose i want to export this data into the excel this is some tricky things how we can do this using laravel 9 right so please like and subscribe this channel for upcoming video and uh, thanks for watching this video have a good day bye